Welcome to our channel Planner Tips. In this tutorial, uh, you will learn that how we can create the procedural star fabric material in Blender with the help of nodes. And here you can see that I add a lot of different combinations of the nodes to create this star fabric material. And here I plug in all the required color and essential value into the group input node. And here by pressing tab, you can see the custom node group of the procedural star fabric material. And here you can see the different parameters and color. To control this fabric material and if I increase the scale then you can see the stars are scaling down and uh, this is the fabric color you can change the fabric color according to your requirement and uh, this is the star a color actually this is the inner part of the star color and here you can see you can change the color according to you beautiful and uh, this is the outer star layer color and here you can see the changings and uh, these are the other parameters and here are star scales and here you can see the stars are scales up and down and this is the beep scale and if i zoom in this and here you can see the nice weave details and uh, from here we can control these weave details up and down beautiful and the another parameters are this is the roughness you can control the roughness of the fabrics and this is the sheen weight and here you can see and if i change this color then you can see the sheen weight clear and if you want to purchase this material along with all of my other material, then you can visit my Patreon page and government stores. Links are in descriptions. So let's start. First, I open the blender and uh, set up the scene. And here you can see that this is the CD report. And here I am in camera view and also in a rendered view. And I convert this plane. Actually, this is the plane which I convert into the cloth by using the cloth physics properties. And if I enter into the edit mode of this plane, then you can see that this is the highly subdivided object. Beautiful. And here this is the shader editor. And here I rename this material procedural stars fabric material, which is I am going to create. Nice. First, I add the weave details to this cloth. So for that, by pressing Shift A here, I search for wave texture and place the wave texture something like here. Beautiful. And uh, by pressing Ctrl T, this will be at the texture coordinate and mapping. This is due to the node regular add on. And here I use the UV coordinate of this object. And uh, by press, selecting the wave texture, by press Ctrl Shift, we can preview the wave texture. Here I change some setting of this wave textures. Here I increase the scale up to, to 70. And uh, here I decrease the detail to the zero, and here I increase the distortion up to five. And uh, if I zoom in this, here you can see the nice details. And uh, here I select this wave texture, and by pressing Ctrl Shift and T, this will be duplicate with the wires plugin. And uh, here I preview this wave texture, and I remain the all setting same but here this is in x direction and here i change to the y direction and i want to mix both these wave textures so for that by selecting both these wave textures and press ctrl 0 this will be at the mix color to combine these wave textures and here i use this result into the normal and ctrl shift to preview this nice and here you can see this is the shading issue because uh, this is the color data and this is the normal data to convert it by pressing shift a here i search for the bump node and place the bump node here and uh, also the normal into the height beautiful and here you can see the weaves detail clear but the bump strength is too much high here i decrease is bump content to half 
beautiful now it's look better nice now i want to add the star pattern to this cloth so for that here i search for the voronoi texture and uh, place the voronoi texture something like here and uh, also move this mapping and texture coordinate here and here i use the same mapping beautiful and uh, here i adjust this voronoi texture first i preview this and here i change the setting and here i increase the scale up to the 10 and uh, here i also change uh, this uh, euclidean type to the min koshi beautiful and uh, here i decrease the randomness to the point point zero ten beautiful nice and here you can see the stars are formed but i want to make the star clearly so for that here i search for the math node and place the math node something like here and uh, here i change this function to the less than beautiful and here you can see the stars but here i scale down these stars so here i type the value point 300 beautiful now these stars looking better nice and uh, i duplicate this pattern by selecting control shift and t with the wires and place this pattern something like here and here i also change uh, some settings and here i decrease the threshold value up to the point 150 and here you can see uh, nothing changing because i add the mix rgb mix color to these both textures so by press selecting these math nodes and press control zero this will be mix both of these textures beautiful and uh, here i want to add uh, some colors to these stars and fabrics so for that first i duplicate this mix node by pressing a shift d and place it something like here and uh, here i plug in this value into this vector and uh, this into the this vector beautifully and the result of first mix into the a of the second beautiful now i change the color and uh, this is the color of the fabrics and here i change the color accordingly nice and uh, this is the color of the star and here you can see i change the color and actually this is the outer layer of the star color and uh, this is the inner layer of the star color and here i choose the blue color beautiful now here you can see the beautiful patterns of the star procedural star fabric material is formed nice and here i use this principal bsdf here and uh, here i put this into the base color and also into the surface beautiful and here you can see the result here you can see the material is too much shiny to decrease the roughness here i increase the roughness strength up to the point 750 beautiful and here i increase decrease uh, some more value and here i open this sheen panel and here i increase the sheen weight up to the point 500 and uh, here you can see the nice reflection on the cloth and we can change this reflection color here i change the sheen tint and here i chose this pink value beautiful nice now here is the final procedural setup of the procedural star fabric material beautiful and by pressing f12 you can view and render it and here is the final render of the procedural stars fabric material.